The Historic Downtown Neighborhood Plan is a project that is intended to follow the official community plan from 2016. That was a project called Abbots Forward where we plan the future of the entire city. And Historic Downtown Neighborhood Plan is focused on just the Historic Downtown Neighborhood, trying to figure out in a little bit more detail about what we're trying to support and the er neighborhood we're trying to create. This neighborhood plan began in 2000, spring of 2017 and has been going on for the past two years. The Historic Downtown Neighborhood Plan focuses on helping create shopping streets in the neighborhood, um, fostering the historic design of the area and keeping that going in the future, and creating new places for people to socialize and gather. So the three main highlights of the Historic Downtown Neighborhood Plan are that we're trying to continue supporting shopping streets in the area, um, trying to continue the historic design and character of the neighborhood into the future, and create more places for people to socialize and gather. The community's been involved through a lot of different ways. We've had an open house and a pop-up shop in downtown. We've done an online survey. We've done stakeholder workshops. And through all those different activities, we've had 7,000 interactions with residents. One of the most memorable engagement experiences we did in Historic Downtown was uh, hosting a pop-up shop in Historic Downtown. Uh, we took over a storefront, a vacant storefront, and we created a temporary gallery space for three days that happened at the same time as the Winter Jubilee Christmas Tree Lighting Festival. The timeline for Historic Downtown and the implementation of the plan is, is unique. Uh, it's one of the neighborhoods that already has a foundation of character that can continue to be built on and doesn't need to have areas of the neighborhood being created from scratch. So one of the really neat things that we have in Historic Downtown is that there are already a thousand residential units that are under development application at the city. So I think over time in the next five years, you'll see a lot more of those new apartment buildings and residential units and more people living and coming downtown to shop and socialize.